Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play some more DSP. So we are back and uh, yeah, we're going to continue here on today. Um, let's get some stuff crafted, just just so we have a bunch of things ready for the future here. Um, just so I have it. So uh, I guess you can see them there. It's too bad it doesn't show a number here just for fun. I guess it doesn't have to, but sometimes I get lazy, you know. Uh, let's get more of these guys going. It's nice to get just a bunch of things going here. Um... Yeah, we're just we're just doing a bunch of things here to be fair. Oh, 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 we have these being developed now, don't we? I think we do. <laughs> I guess we should go up here and grab that, huh? We worked hard on that. Yeah, we got both the glass and the... Oh, yeah, did we send filters? Oh, yeah, we did. Good. It would have kind of sucked if we never put a filter on there, to be fair, so... Just there you go. That'll help out a lot there. Okay, so... Um, yeah, these guys... I just want to get a bunch of stuff up and running. I guess I do these, you know, I'll do these. Uh, you know what? Oh, I'm out of material now. Which one? Iron plates, just regular iron plates. I forgot that was a thing. There you go. And back to these guys. What are we up to? That's not bad time-wise to craft all that. Okay, now we're, now we're getting out of the other good materials here. So let's get one of these going here. Look like we needed some of these here as well. Perfect. Oh, sometimes my shift doesn't work. I don't know if that's the game. Probably the game acting up a bit. This has happened multiple times. I'm guessing it just derps up sometimes. That's all right. Okay, we got that going. Um, depot. Yeah, we want to get more of these guys going for sure. Cause storage is always important. Uh, let's get more miners going here as well. And. I probably should get more of these guys. I mean, I'll use more of them over time anyway, so I'll just make 10. So the idea is I'm just making a lot of stuff here for the future. Basically just kind of getting ready for um, upgrading and getting more in here. I might try jamming more in here because it is kind of fun to do that. But eventually it's not efficient. We're going to have to start like a new section of the base where we, you know, are a little bit more efficient in our designs. You know, a huge iron array, things like that. But I'm not too, I'm not too crazy about that right now. I don't, I don't care. I'm, I'm having fun, and I don't mind being even on the slower level of things as long as it, you know, we're doing okay. Um, I was thinking for a second what I wanted to do here. <laughs> I had something in my mind, and it's like completely gone. Oh yeah, I wanted to check these guys out. Yeah, so might as well just put that in there. There you go. So I think we're good. Yeah, we had uh, last time I think we filled up our ammo and everything yet. And it's going to take a while to get that thread up. Our production of these is kind of slow. But then again, it's not like we've done a good job or anything on it, to be fair. It's pretty bad. And these guys, I don't think they even run. They do 20 a minute. But yeah, the whole thing is slow. So it's, it's more of this is the issue, I think, here. Now, I forget, does this do it like factorial? Can I actually daisy chain these? I actually forget if I could do that. For some reason, my mind I, it says yes, you could, but I don't actually remember. I wouldn't do this forever, but for now, why not? If it works, right? Oh, yeah, we have to go like this. No, it looks like that is a no. Okay, well, when that's done, we'll just take this out and I'll redo this part of it, I guess. Which, there you go. Battlefield, I don't know if I can craft that, we'll see. I'm kind of interested in this device though. Oh boy, um, you need glass, is that? No, it looks something different. Maybe it's just, no, we, we already have glass. Yeah, so that's something different, another material. And we're also missing, I guess, steel on there as well, huh? Yeah. Which is three iron to steel. Yeah, so we really need to set up a steel thing. That's fine. Okay. So let's set up this. Let's let's make this a little faster. This is not going to be the best, you know, production. But I don't know if these stack. I know you can make these. Oh, yeah, you can make them stack. Does that mean I can make this production stack too, I wonder? I don't remember. Let's Let's do it. You can. Now we're talking, my friends. Now we're talking here. Okay. It's not like I need that really to stack too much because it's like we already produced enough. But if we can make these stack, then this should be more than enough for us to get somewhere, if you know what I mean. 
as long as they take from both i'm hoping and then yeah so we're gonna change this to research they all okay so they all act like one building i guess ish something like that i guess yeah i don't know exactly how it works but i don't see any of them holding oh there is holding in there there you go okay that works okay yeah, it definitely is pulling out. Okay, so that's that's working really well. Okay, that's that's sweet. Damn, that's that's actually really cool for compactness too. Okay, so let's go ahead and check our research here. Uh, so steel smelting, I think, should be the next priority. Period. I'm I'm guessing this thing is just gonna keep up the whole time. You could probably upgrade this even more. Although, keep in mind power constraints here. Oh gosh, yeah, it's <laughs> yeah. Those power constraints kind of hit us really fast in this game. Um, yeah, we're already having issues with iron again. So let's go and deal with that. There you go. When in doubt, blame power. Right. Oh, we're finally through you guys too, huh? Okay. I, I feel sad for the amount I've had to create here. Let's get more turrets going though, because I guess we can use a couple more of those eventually here. So do we just keep going over here, I guess? Yeah, might as well. That's that's crazy how much power we've been using. I actually feel like we've been using a lot more power than I'm used to. I don't know why. You can't tell me it was this bad before, or was it? Like... Do, 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 do. Go. Why sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't work. Or if it's a distance thing, or I just derped up somehow, or it's just the way the game is, you know. I feel like this could have been better. I think there's a pipit tool, isn't there? I don't know. I tried to use Q or middle mouse. It doesn't work. I feel like there was, but I mean, they might have never added one. I feel like that'd be crazy if they did, though. Yeah, I guess the water there or the land way. I don't know. It is does definitely feels weird, but yeah. Well, now we got steel production so maybe we should do a new setup for iron on that like well that's kind of cool so you can keep going on the <laughs> can't use it all the time because it has the temporary amount but uh, it will work over that okay so yeah we have more iron over here i know that it's not like we have all the space taken up or anything you know we you know we, we could deal with this let's get out a new miner though Let's make this a little easier on us. Add a new miner. I think that adds to all of them, yeah. That's pretty good. Okay. And then we can bring this down somewhere else, like over here, maybe. Okay. And then we should probably add a power thing over here. You just. You know, might as well fill these in the gap, right? That's kind of what you do anyways in your base over time is fill those in a bit more just so you have the space. Okay, so let's go ahead. Let's do... Do you want to do three of these, I guess? If we do three of them, then we can... Uh, yeah, we can produce a bit more anyway. So there you go. So we're going to do this. So copy, paste... There you go. Perfect. And then, did I make a bunch of these? I think we did. Oh yeah, yeah we definitely did. Oh, yeah, I have to do it like that. Did I screw up there? Yeah. There we go. I wonder, maybe I should just do it like this and then 
over here. Although I do that again, and then isn't the whole point of this to do something like this again? Yeah. You think that's enough room? I don't know for sure. No, it's not. Nice try. We have to go a little bit more. There you go. It'll still help, but yeah, we'll have to clean that up. There you go. This is what I used to do in like Factorio, and I think even probably this game, to be fair. The standard method, of, you know. But I should probably, because I want to make sure I get this all in here. Um, something like this, maybe. Yeah, something the protection like this, probably. facility has stopped running. If it's not due to a power failure, check if products overflow. It's probably or just if there stuff. aren't enough raw materials. These may cause facilities to fail. Plan your factory in a reasonable manner and balance production and consumption to ensure orderly operation. There you go. There we have it. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Probably still helps bring all this in here. So, oh, no, I screwed up. Well, it's not a big screw up because it's still the same, but uh, I forgot that it's uh, the one and then the other. So I got to do this. There you go. I don't know how I forgot about that. There you go. It's not a big deal because I can do that. But then, yeah, maybe I should fix this up, huh? That's all right. We all make mistakes. There you go. And then, yeah, so we're going to have to do, I mean, it's three to one, two, I guess, at that point. So just do two of those. I guess it is, right? Oh, it's 60 a minute still. Oh, no, that's for that. Sorry, I'm being dumb. I have to look at this one. What is this here? Three seconds? Oh, three seconds. Okay. Yeah, so I guess that's how it works. It's just two to uh, three to one, I guess. Just leave an extra space for room and stuff later on if I want it. Okay. I feel like that's in the way, but whatever. Now we're going to put you here. We're going to put you here. We're going to put you here and you here. Okay. And then we can take these guys. Perfect, so we got steel now. Is my butt's too big to fit in there? What the? That was weird, I guess the water or something? I'm not sure, it was just, it was really like not wanting me to do anything there, it seemed. Okay, and there's our steel. Drones would be worth uh, upgrading eventually here because our drones are so slow. Fluid storage, high plasma control, huh? Oh. I was like ciders and prisms and stuff like that. That's pretty cool. We can do that for fun. What else we got here? Uh, fluid storage. I mean, we might as well queue that up next. I think that's pretty much it for that one. And then we can work on the, the other stuff here. We'll decide. Oh, there's the semiconductor material. So that's the. It's more advanced, obviously. So. And then, yeah, let's go down here and we'll start putting these in here. Oops. There you go, we got steel going. Perfect. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, that's good. I think I got these guys now. So this makes this. How do we get these guys made anyways over time? Ah, glass. It's just a bunch of glass to the prism. Ah, that's not bad. We can easily do that up here. Don't. 
There you go. Prisms being made. That's awesome. Oh, that threat's going up. Looks like we'll be able to actually use something with that threat today. Okay, so let's see here. Steel smelting, combustion unit, eh? This must be more for other... huh. Power, more efficient power units. Oh, this is power? Okay. And then what do you got? Smelting purification. Oh, look at this. All this stuff. Silicon ore. Yeah, we can just queue all this up. Semiconductor. Thermal power, eh? Oh, okay, coal and stuff. 2.16, huh? I mean, that might help us with some of our power issues, to be honest. Plasma extract. Proof crude oil. Oh, okay, crude oil stuff. Damn, that's going to really get us some upgrades there. And this stuff, it was all mostly, oh, yeah, it was mortars and it was items. These are all mostly item-based. Well, not this one, but one extra construction drone is nice. But that'll give us something to do for a while anyways. Maybe we should uh, increase this because that's what I was going to do anyways. What's that symbol mean? I don't think that's a bad thing, right? Coal can release power more efficiently. Oh, that's actually the uh, <laughs> uh, power state's actually the research. I was like, ah, what's going on here? It's like we can put coal in here, apparently. Ah, so we've we've reached a max uh, height on this. Interesting. Didn't know that was a thing. But we can we can always increase it more later on. I mean, we're not doing too bad bad for power, right? No. We could always move this along here. How are you doing, anyways? Oh good, you're going to slow down eventually here. <laughs> I think this is keeping up anyway, as I'm guessing. I say that, but this is... Oh no, I guess it is. Yeah. I think I'm going to try this out. Perfect. And yeah. There you go. And then we should get these guys going here. And yeah, there you go. Oh wait, you guys aren't actually keeping up? Wait, hell, I thought these guys were keeping up, but apparently they weren't actually keeping up. Oh, interesting, okay. I guess depending on the speed of certain researches and stuff, so. Yeah, okay, well, whatever. I guess if it buffers or whatever, it'll do better. If not, that's fine. Cool. I thought wrong. I thought definitely wrong there. How is our attack here? 89. Oh, it's definitely happening. I put more of those up there. I don't know if that was enough for protection, but... That's pretty darn good, to be fair. I feel like one could go over here somewhere. Got three more of these guys. I can't wait to upgrade my uh, speed a bit more too. I'm so bloody slow. Oh. Get this turret going here. <laughs> 
activate supernova. Apparently that's an achievement. Okay. Turret swell can enter your while the accumulator tire will enter a five second burst mode. When the grid power supply is lower and the lumen will switch off automatically. Once the uh, is enabled, click this button again to turn off. Oh, I see. This is probably eating too much of the power grid because it says it turns off automatically. Oh yeah, there you go. So once it hits 70%, this would turn off supernova mode. Oh. Cool. Okay. I don't think we have to worry too much because I think we're going to be doing fine here. And they're coming. They're definitely coming. 5% left. So we have a lot of things we've made over time here. So silicon, I didn't even know there was silicon, but I guess there is silicon somewhere. In the planet view, oh. you can hold the middle mouse button to rotate no, the camera. I thought we already did that. In the planet view, yeah, there's none. scrolling the mouse wheel also. I feel like we've already done that part, but maybe not. He just likes to talk, I guess. I'm kind of just waiting on this uh, to happen now. What's this one? Graphite. Oh, I see. Coal. Or, oh, a bunch of stuff. <laughs> it's like the complex stuff. <laughs> I feel bad how slow steel is, but I mean, that's just part of it. Yeah, we never actually capped this. Let's do 10 cap for now. I feel like I'll need more than that over time, though, for steel. Yeah, I still need these guys here. We get the yeah we do have it here. Oh, that's still silicon, which we can do from rock. Is that rock stone? I guess a stone to silicon. Oh, okay, it's very expensive, but maybe early on it's kind of important to do a bit. Okay, ninety nine point seven, ninety nine point eight, ninety nine point nine, one hundred percent. So it looks like they're going to come back from the same way anyways. Do I have a turret here? I do have a turret here and I have a turret here. So technically this should be all covered. I'm going to stay back. I don't want to see it in action, but I think we're going to be fine. So There they are, yeah. Doesn't look like this is going to be much of an issue, so. They come. Not a problem. They look like they keep going till they get hit, then they get distracted. So, obviously, if they can't take them out fast enough, that could be an issue, but. Uh, Definitely the turrets did just more than enough there. And now each shot, was that like one shot or was it like a burst? Like it was hard to tell there. So let's see how much ammo we have. Oh, okay. I don't know why it shows the weird one there. It's how much you have left. Oh, okay. Cause it's like a, I guess each thing of ammo is like actually like a thing on it. It has a cooldown on it though. Or I guess, no, that's probably not a cooldown. Could have a cooldown. All Tourette's have a powerful ability. Supernova. Tourette's will accumulate a large amount of energy for a short time once Supernova has been enabled. After accumulating, Tourette's will enter burst mode and fire extremely quickly for several seconds. Note, Supernova costs a massive amount of power. It can't be used if power supply is too low. I swear he kept saying Tourette's over and over. I'm like, eh. Am I crazy to think that's what it was saying? I mean, obviously I know it's not that. Like, you know, not actually Tourette's. So Tourette's and Tourette's are different. But I swear he was saying Tourette's the whole time. I think I'm just going crazy. Okay, let's take this. And let's go over here.
Oh, it's the other one. Okay, that makes sense. So we're going to do this one here. There we go. at the end of it anyway so it's not like a big deal it's whatever you can get out of it right and then we got this guy here which do you make something too I guess I don't know let's see yeah you do no sorry this one yeah there you go it's a little on the expensive side obviously but It's at the end of it too, and this is like eating it all up, so you're not gonna get as much as you think out of that right now, anyways. You can always speed it up though. more through this setup now. It's crazy that you have to do 10 of these though. <laughs> uh, 10 of them to get what one of them and then oh I guess they're in there so I probably should start dumping those out huh. Do 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 there you go. And then we need a bunch of those for there. Okay, well we're getting somewhere anyways. Not too shy, not too shabby. It's gonna take a little bit more work, but it's working, so. So you don't have to worry because they get destroyed anyways I think when you place stuff on top okay how many of these we got now nice so we wanted to build this whichever the hell this thing is supposed to be so I guess we're gonna have that now or can make that sorry we there we go produce one nice 50 seconds Also requires a bunch of engines. I'm not quite sure how this works, so core of the battlefield controlling with powerful real time battlefield as command ability. Self equipped fighters can be dispatched from the base. Uh, destroyed building will automatically be marked with a hologram. Construction drones will then dispatch the building. Oh interesting. So it sounds like it's more like that kind of control. I thought maybe it Well we'll see. I thought it showed a little bit more information. It might. Not too bad. I guess this is done catching up now. It's like, yeah. Let's see. Let's do upgrades because upgrades are fun. There you go. Drone engine. That would be fun for the drone engines. Well, there's a shield here. This might be fun. Vertical stuff. That's much later on. Oh, look at this. Weapon damage, so increase turret damage a bit more. I guess energy would be my weapon, I guess. I don't have explosive, but whatever. <laughs> Vein utilization. Oh, that's later on. 
<laughs> Excuse me. Drive engine, mecha flight. That's pretty cool. I wouldn't mind that. Maybe next time we can work on those and get those drive ones going, because that would be pretty cool, to be fair. More drone. Yeah, that's not bad. What's this one? Auto reconstruction. Blah, blah, blah. Why not? It's blue. Communication control. Cool. We have shields. Oh, they're charging up too. That's Congratulations. Cool. You've unlocked energy shield. It can resist all damage from enemies and protect all facilities within its radius. Energy shield requires Mecha's core energy to charge. The charging speed depends on the current fuel chamber power generation, as well as the Mecha's current energy percentage. Once the shield's power is exhausted, it takes some time to restart. Makes sense. Okay. So yeah, we got the shields now anyways, so. Very cool. Okay, so, oh yeah, we're building that thingy mabop. Let's get that plop down wherever it is. Is it still building it? No. I can't find it. Oh, there it is. It's like it's somewhere here. Oh, that's kind of cool. A little bit ridiculous in size. <laughs> Well, that looks really You've cool. Built a battlefield analysis base. It can automatically dispatch construction drones for constructing. Oh, it has them built in. And combat drones for defending. It can also analyze enemy debris and automatically extract useful items. A battlefield analysis base is indispensable for building an unmanned auto defense system. I just realized there's ranges to it. So, I mean, yeah, it'll do fine here, but it would be uh, not, this doesn't quite capture my whole base. I guess if you move it right direction, possibly, but I guess you'll need multiples of these over time. We won't figure that out today. <laughs> we're, we're doing pretty well, I think. We got lots to learn, though. Okay, how are we doing here? I don't know if these guys have been growing at all. I know they're in space too. I don't know how that works, so. Are they in space? Oh yeah, here they are. As far as I know, this would be building and slowly constructing as we've been playing, or at least that's my understanding. I'm not sure how that works though, but. Interesting. Cool. Okay. Doing lots of upgrades now. We got water pump. Oh, okay. Pump liquid to oceans, including sulfuric. Uh, okay, so that's sulfuric. Got your oil extractor, oil refinery. So we're going to need these guys in the future as well, for sure. Uh, and then we had this power thing. It looked like it gave us a freebie, but 2.16 versus what are these doing? 300. So this is, it's bigger in size, but it should provide us a lot more piao for what we got here. Where is our coal production here? Isn't this coal? Oh, here it is. So we probably could just fit this on here and have some coal production. I think these chained up, if I recall. It's been a long time, to be fair. Wait, what? A thermal power plant? This kind of power facility consumes chemical fuel. Ensure adequate fuel supply at all times so the plant can consistently generate power. Why? That's annoying. I think I just turned it off now, but yeah. You think it would come from me first or something? But interesting, anyways. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, looks like that'll keep up. Yeah, I think you can stack these and chain them and stuff like that. And that way they provide uh, a decent amount of uh, fuel over time. Weapon damage, nice. Okay, let's maybe we try that out for fun. Do, 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 do. Where are we? There we are. Yeah. I think that's how it worked, but I don't know now. 
You know, I forget if these can go in or out of these directly. No. For some reason I thought maybe they could, but... We can do that, though. Okay, so that works. Okay. You might want to have the other one set up, too, just in case. Yeah, it looks like that works. I fit another one in here for fun. <laughs> Good way of doing compact power, to be fair, though, so I can't really complain. Because if it works, it works, right? All right. I mean, you can go up a bit, but... I guess you can... There you go. Oh yeah, 200 uh, or 20 megawatt achievement. Awesome. That'll work. Yeah, there you go. Okay, well power is not going to be much of an issue now. Grid load, 40%. So yeah, we're doing uh, pretty good here. Not bad. Look at the footprint here. <laughs> Compared to so far all the wind turbines. Kind of crazy. It definitely helps anyways. Okay, I think we'll leave it there, my friends. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed this. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and we'll see wonderful people next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.